this doesn't want to shut off. Take a look at the snow piles. Snow. Alright, so you probably can't see it, and this isn't exactly accurate, but that says it's about 36, 36 degrees. So stuff has melted off some, but yesterday, um, it melted some too, but yesterday morning, this pile was as tall as me, if not a little bit taller, and I'm about, well, I'm a little over 5'7". Yeah. We got this big section of driveway here. Half of it comes here, and the other half goes out back. And of course, this is melted down some too. And be careful. I don't want to get my shoes wet. Yeah, pretty soon it'll all be gone. We'll be back at the river prospecting, looking for the gold, the cheddar. The AU, don't you know? I'm excited, aren't you? Yeah, we'll go back down to the shop now. Down the shop, where we at? Where we at? Am I covering the microphone? Probably. So, I've come to the conclusion that I've definitely got to get myself a CNC router because I can get out of a four foot sheet easily five of them because they'd be cut like you see them sitting here but as it stands right now I can only get four the way I'm doing it so I'm wasting material but I have no choice because I have to cut everything on the table saw with the sled that I made so CNC router is a must. I'm gonna have to get one at some point, but that takes money. It takes the do re me, and I'm constantly putting money back into the business because all this stuff, well, it ain't cheap. <laughs> it ain't cheap at all, not at all. But right now I have seven of the full size all ready to go, boxed up, and eight. Of the small ones boxed up ready to go and another one that is going to be cured by tomorrow it'll be boxed up so that'll be nine and today I've had to and I gotta get more styrofoam to cut that these are all the things that slow me down stopping to cut up stuff like this this morning I had to work on tubes and today I've got to cut more of these up and the longer plates the ends have to be sanded and rounded, just beveled, bull-nosed, if you will. And I've got a bunch of material. All that stuff's got to be sanded. The ends, these are all the things that make you feel like you're not getting anything done. But once you get all that prepped out, it's just building, um, which goes much quicker. I did the 23 inch pay streak finder tubes this morning and I've still got more down there that I have to mark and drill and then clean. So those are the 23 inch I just did today. I had two left enough to do one more 23 inch pay streak finder so it was time. And I boxed up number eight of the 23 inch pay streak finders today. I got that in the inventory. So now I have to switch gears and I don't know what I'm gonna do <laughs> I'll just uh, toss a coin sand or cut probably cut I gotta get more stuff cut up alright so thank you for watching everybody a little bit of an update Green Mountain Gold Trap just still busy down here living down in the shop 
working, working, working. I do sleep, believe me, I do sleep, and I take little breaks in between, and I'm drinking my fruit smoothies every day, getting all jacked up, getting jacked up. So don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and yeah, I practice every day too. See ya. Uh, one last thing, yep, I did a bunch of cutting, a bunch more cutting. But uh, end of the day, I decided I'm going to stop cutting and I'm going to start working on my concentrates for the 2020 season. That's all the bigger stuff, the plus 30, plus 20. Um, yeah, so that's, that's pretty damn good. Not too bad. And then I still have the 100 mesh and the 50 mesh. And there's a bunch in there. I don't know if you can see it or not, but quite a bit in there quite a bit in here too quite a bit and of course I didn't get out as much as I would have like two or three years ago I just like I can't anymore <laughs> uh, but hey sweet and sour sweet and sour I'm doing something I love given other prospectors something that they can use that works well and uh, hey I enjoy it but anyway once I get all this I'm not going to once I get this dried out we'll weigh it up and see what's there for the bigger stuff and this stuff here I'm gonna set up the blue bowl and uh, try the uh, the dream mat that I've put in the blue bowl and see how that works out but anyway, everybody like to go. See ya. All right. Well, I have not gotten anything done today. <laughs> I knew once I started messing with this gold, the 2020 season concentrates. Um, I wouldn't. Uh, I'd, I'd just have to keep going, and that's what I did today. So I got it all done. That is the minus 50 and minus 100 I got it all cleaned up and I don't really care for the dream mat for the blue bowl but it worked um, and that's of course the bigger stuff so once this gets dried up I'll get it in here and weigh it up now what I did was I've got a whole ton of these little vials that I ordered that I, I give away for every purchase of the, gold, the Green Mountain Gold Traps and uh, so I, I went through and I found two that were exactly the same weight. And I don't know if you'll be able to see. I put a mark on the top of the cap. You can kind of see a line through it. Right in the center. And a mark on that one. So those two are exactly the same weight. So I can uh, weigh it up and get the proper weight. The I can't remember who it was that... Uh, that pointed out to me that I should weigh these there's two of them here and they're a different weight so that's why I went through those and found two that weigh the same so right now I have close to five grams in here and that's gonna be at least a gram if not a little more so we shall see once that dries up I'll get back to you Another blooper. All right, it's all dry, and I got it in the vial. So let's turn this on. Yep, almost well, almost six grams. 5.91 hmm I thought it would be over 6 but hey that's not bad that's not bad I'm not going to complain about that this year is going to be a lot better well maybe it's five point nine three nine four. it's settling in <laughs> Go ahead, keep going up.
5.94 sweet but as I was saying this year is going to be this year is going to be a lot better because of what we're going to be doing the research that's been done over the winter via a state geologist who has access to information that other people don't have access to nice feel the weight <laughs> alright catch y'all later let's see what I have all together over the last few years I'm just gonna use Oops, forgot that was in there. twenty seven point well that was rude of my camera <laughs> anyway it uh... it's twenty seven now it's saying twenty seven point one two and it just shut off but it was twenty seven point one five oh there's a piece looks like some of it spilled out so that's uh pretty close to an ounce pretty close to an ounce awesome alright that's gonna conclude this video gotta love gold right see ya stupid